Hey, this is Reed, aka Carnivorous Chef. To start, you'll need one pound of chicken tenderloins. This is enough to make two of these chicken fillets. Remove from the packaging and cut the tenders into bite-sized pieces. If you can't remove it from the packaging, find an emergency axe and obliterate the packaging open. Next, season with a half teaspoon of your seasoning of choice. I use my Carnivore Companion Smokestack seasoning. You don't have to add in any oil, but I added just a touch just to get the seasoning more evenly distributed. Mix this until you're confident that every surface of the chicken has some seasoning on it. Set this aside for 20 minutes to give the chicken a light cure. While we're waiting on this, grab some deli meat of your choice and quarter it. I just happen to use a little pack of corned beef. Unfortunately, separating the pieces is not an optional step unless you just really want giant pockets of deli meat. To assemble, you'll need a couple of skewers and some thick cut bacon. Okay, here's the mildly awkward part. Grab a small handful of your chicken in one hand and a few pieces of the deli meat with your other hand. We want to layer these together until roughly half of each has been used up. Compress it into a round disc as well as you can. And here's the part where you'll probably be skeptical about this holding together, but buckle up and get ready. Grab a strip of your bacon and tightly wrap it around the pile of chicken and skewer it all the way through. Pick it up and be amazed that it actually stays together. If it doesn't, you messed it up and you need to try it again. My instructions were obviously flawless. If you need some more time, I'll make another one while you try this again. Okay, it's finally time to cook these. I added just a touch of extra salt because I know my seasoning isn't the saltiest. Hit it on both sides with a little more. Now, throw this into an oven at 450 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes or until the center of the filet reads 160 degrees Fahrenheit near the skewer. They look so damn good. While I'm taking this bite, why don't you hit that like and subscribe button for me? Maybe even check out this next video that's suggested for you. I bet you'll love it too.